Hey, how you guys doing? My name is Cambrell Willis, and I'm from Miami, Florida. I'm doing a piece called Walter. Uh, it's one of my first monologues, and basically Walter is sharing information with Jessica about how his mom and best friend died. Hopefully you guys like it. Oh, you waiting for me to... We were just getting our report cards. I get A's and B's, so you know that's not a story. But Nate got a D. If you know Nate, getting only one D on your report card is a big deal. My mom was so proud of him. When she got off of work, she took us out to dinner, and we got to see the midnight showing of I can't remember what we saw. I can remember my mom on the way home saying, put on your seatbelt. Put on your seatbelt. Walter, put on your seatbelt. I didn't put on my seatbelt. What's the name of the movie? We get outside the neighborhood, a car runs the red light and crashes into us. I go flying out the window and onto the street. I broke my collarbone, my leg, and I had a concussion. Mom died instantly. Nate died a week later from complications, so I guess he's not a cat. But that's not the worst part of it. You see, my dad died from drugs, so I know death happens. But what pisses me off is my stepfather signing a contract waiver that gets me a little money now and a lot of money when I turn 18 for physical and emotional damage, but prevents me from telling anyone who's responsible for killing my mom and best friend, or I could face jail time. Ain't that a bitch? You'll probably run into Nate's little brother in these halls so many times and he won't even know who you are because everybody's settled. Nobody went to court. Also, your boyfriend's brother can be a football star. And what pisses me off even more is I know you wasn't the person that was driving that car that crashed into us. I was concussed, but I know what I saw. 